Engineering is a complex domain that requires engineers to solve uh, problems uh, using their knowledge. Uh, so it makes sense for us to involve students in learning that's based on problem situations. Uh, and given that engineers need more than just uh, factual knowledge to be successful in an ill-structured and complex environment, problem-based learning seems well suited to prepare for future engineers. So in this study, we wanted to assess whether PBL, problem-based learning, uh, develops students' conceptual understanding and increases their ability to solve ill-defined problems. So we had 55 undergraduate students in an introductory electrical engineering course that participated in that study. Uh, we used both traditional lecture and problem-based learning in this study in an ABAB research design over 16-week uh, course to examine differences between whether traditional lecture or problem-based learning increases students' conceptual understanding of the topic. Uh, during the PBL approach, students worked in three to four uh, students per team uh, where they solve hypothetical uh, problems that mirror what students would encounter in the field as future engineers. During the traditional lecture approach, uh, they just receive the material through uh, lecture-based uh, teaching method. We assess students' conceptual understanding using open-ended problems uh, in a pre-post-test format, and we found that students perform twice as well when learning from problem-based learning condition as opposed to when they were learning from traditional lecture condition. We also gave students a uh, survey at the end of the course to assess their perceptions of learning from PBL and traditional lecture and what they thought um, helped them more in terms of their learning outcomes. And we found that students actually thought that their traditional lecture helped them learn more as opposed to problem-based learning. So our results uh, support that PBL works and it can help students uh, solve ill-structured uh, problems and increases their conceptual understanding. However, their perceptions are always not accurate. So what they think they learn from best might not always accurately reflect what, they what method they actually learn best from.